The man crab was slumped over a table at the tabard inn. He wetted his brain in beer and it weighed heavy. The drunkards discussed how thanks to the flag that had been after everyone in town and carried them off. Crab told it was time some brave souls stood up to that. And he quickly exited the pub looking for his closest friends Deep and Cut. He firstly got to Deep's house and woke him up. Then suddenly Cut arrived and Crab talked them into killing death. They looked for death in the graveyard. They looked for death in the fields, but he'd long gone leaving the flowers to wither and the leaves sooner or later to fall. Just when they thought they'd caught him up, the old wrinkled coon on legs told them he'd left death under the oak tree. They reached the tree, but death wasn't there, just an old pot. It was a miracle! They were rich, and Grab sent Deep to fetch some wine so they could celebrate their luck. When counting the gold, Grab and Cut told they couldn't divide it three ways, and supposed Deep was to get an accident. Meanwhile, on his way into town, Deep got a brilliant idea. He quickly went to the nearest pub, which was the Tabor Inn, bought three bottles of wine, then very carefully he poured all of the poison in two of them and hurried to claim his gold. As soon as Deep got back to the oak tree, he offered the bottles of wine to his friends and suddenly along the road came the play card with dead bodies. The friends remember taking a note to kill dead, but instead they killed Deep and drank to their newfound fortune. In the morning, Dad came back for his pot of gold. The three corpses made no move to stop him, and he left them to a welt of flies and crows before continuing his endless journey. <laughs>